And I got Medicine 4. Great. Let's get rid of a Medicine 3, I suppose. Oh wow, I actually have quite a lot of Medicine 3s. I'll use up another one. Ah, well. It's a slight waste, but whatever. Medicine fucking hell. Four. I have so much medicine fours. It's a little crazy. Oh, I think this is... Oh, maybe not. I think this brings us out either on Dr. Clamp's floor or just above it. Oh, another pterodactyl. Oh, then you bitch. And you missed. Sucks to be you, bud. Ammo plus 30. Yeah, they give you so much. Especially when you only have to use, like, five bullets to take care of most of them. It's absolutely insane. Another enemy? I think this one's a pterodactyl and just a regular dragon. A dragon. <laughs> Dinosaur. No, it's... God, it's such a small room. Yeah, I have a tendency of calling dinosaurs dragons. I don't know why. <laughs> oh, you douche. It's just something I always catch myself doing, and then I realise, like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Wrong thing. Wrong era. What's over here? <gasps> Ooh. I can go south or I can go left, maybe. Is that really just... is that a, Oh, it's a painting and a wall. <laughs> it looked like a doll frame. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> oh, I'm stupid. Is this... No, this is the floor above Dr. Clamps. I think so. Can I go in here, though? Yeah, I can. <laughs> oh, sh shit. Okay, yeah, I do remember this. Hey, did someone just lock the door? Uh, yeah, they did. It won't open. He must have locked it. You bastard! What do we got? My Imagery as well. I will replace an item. I'll replace a medicine. With an SV protector. Hmm. Do I have any mod slots? Yeah, I do. I might actually get rid of the SV protector then. Is that better or worse? It's only better in terms of crits. Yeah, it's worse. Yeah, I'll just get the plus one item slot. Why not? I have six tools, which is the most tools I'll ever have. Not the bloody shotgun. There, yeah, that one. Boom. Give me this. Uh, yep. Hooray! I can now hold one more item. Which I'll take that back. If in you please. Free medicine. I mean, there's nothing in here, I guess. Our only option is to go out the broken window. I can get out through here. Go through window. This is actually where the pterodactyl came from, I think. If I slip, I'm a goner. Don't slip then. Let's see. I don't even think you can slip. It looks like I can only get in from there. What should I do? Go down. Look at this graceful. Although she does it in a very... Okay, never mind. I thought she quite literally vaulted down. So I was going to say it's a very odd thing to do. Or to choose to do. Phew. Made it. There we go. But no, she, she did it the right way. How she didn't fall over onto her ass, I don't know. Oh. What are we fighting now? Another pterodactyl. These seem to be the only ones I'm going against now. No, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. I avoided it. Yes! Do you actually move quicker depending on the weapon you're using? It seems I do. I do. Honestly, I, I could just be talking right out my ass. But I certainly seem, at least in fights, to move quicker with the pistol equipped than I do with... Say, the shotgun equipped. 
but I don't remember reading anything about whether different guns impact your movability or mobility. As far as I was aware, they didn't. Oh, another fight! It's two dinosaurs. Oh, it's ooh, two dinosaurs and a pterodactyl. Yeah, nice. I didn't want to do that, you douche. Oh well, I'll just have to live with my choice. 57? Yeesh. One down. I certainly do seem to move quicker. Fuck it, actually. What I'll do... I'll just... Okay. I can kind of, I kind of gauge how quick I move. Now let's see. Switch this for the shotgun. Maybe not. Maybe I am talking out my ass. Yeah, I don't think I move any quicker. Which is fair. I just wanted to test, just to see. Also, the G22 has some pretty good range. For a pistol. I think the SMGs are the ones that have got really bad range. It's like sub-50. Either that or the G22 has just got really good range. Ooh, nice level. Woo, yeah. Give me everything. It's locked. <gasps> no. I can, I think, go over here. Which I think is what I need to do. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, ten. Defense plus one. Oh, there's two. Crap. Oh, they like to put chests in places you literally can't see. Douche. Uh, let's see, and protector. So what is this? Two. Of course. <laughs> what else? I was about to say, where am I? <laughs> Oh, museum shop. It's a museum shop tent. Oh, you dicks. Only doing five damage now, though. Oh, dear. I switched targets by accident. I seem to do that. I think it's probably because I'm using the analog stick. It's really easy to move or to change targets. Perhaps a bit too easy. Uh, nothing but drunk. Junk. But the main reason I'm using the analog sticks oh shit, to move around is because you auto-run. Which, if that was an option in the settings, or if that was something you could toggle in the options, I'd have much preferred that. <laughs> in any kind of game, I always like to enable auto-dash. It's just so much easier than having to hold down a button to move. Just to move at a you know, quicker pace. But if I used the D-pad to move around and wanted to sprint, I'd have to move in whatever direction and hold circle. I just don't want to do that. Call it laziness. Ooh, ah. Oh ah, well, how much health am I missing? 180? <gasps> Near enough. Okay, I'm gonna have nothing but medicine fours at this rate. And tools. Nothing but fucking tools. It's a little bit crazy. Oh. Now what do we fight? More dinosaurs and... Yep. Called it. This is where I need to be, though. Alright. Oh, nice. Tell them in four bullets. For once. Oh, dear. You, bitch. Wow. Oh god, it's gonna attack. Woo! And one more bullet should do it. Yeah! Still not really been much of an explanation as to why there are dinosaurs just wandering around. I'm assuming it's to do with Eve. She brought them back to life or some shit. Like a zombie, though. A bit weird. Is there anything over here? I can't get through here. Oh, of course. 
Apparently E, uh, not E's. I can't get through anywhere. No, here we go. Ah, very nice. I can't remember what's in here. A tool, probably. Let's see, where's the alarm? At this point, I'm just kind of like, I should just get rid of as much stuff as possible. So the M203, that's acid. Don't really want to get rid of that. The PPK, yeah. Ooh, that's good stats. Kinda. I'm just trying to free up space. Yeah, there's a... I think it's probably a tool. Oh no, uh, okay. Yeah, it's an SMG. But it's got... It fires seven times, which is already bad. But also it shoots random targets. For each bullet. So I'm just gonna say a big old bye-bye to that. I must put that on to the SMG, no thanks. 1 plus 2. So that will give an, an increase of 11. There we go. Got rid of the shitty thing. Very nice. So now what we need to do is this. Here it is, and it's been activated. Deactivate. I guess it's the security system or something. And then interact with the monitor. Hey, wait a minute. Now we get to see... Oh, Eve. Where is she? That room, where is it? She looks like a really weird, fleshy spider. This is probably the most gross image I could think of. A fleshy spider. Ugh. So we're at 7 hours and 41 minutes. Not too shabby. Alrighty. Now I just need to get back to the second floor, I think. What was that? Oh, oh, right, yeah, yeah. I was wondering. <laughs> is that the red carpet? Oh no, yeah. That is the red carpet. I thought it was all the slime. Yay. Uh, so nasty. That doesn't make sense though. Why can it make noise? It's literally just bone. <laughs> the only noise it should make would be the clatter of bones. It shouldn't be able to roar. <laughs> Maybe it could whistle. I can't believe it. So that's how she controls inanim inanimate objects. And of all things, she's crazy. You're bringing dinosaurs back to life. Crazy bitch. Okay. I think all the, all the stairs should be open now. So, I should be able to go back to the NYPD. Yeah, I might just destroy as much stuff as I can. As long as I keep one tool for the... Oh no, I'd need, I'd need two, wouldn't I? One for the shotgun and then one for dismantling my G22. But I still have five tools. I sell a lot of tools. That's the elevator. Yeah, here we go. Cutscene time! There's someone in there. Dun dun. Freeze! Professor Clem, don't move. Put your hands in the air where I can see him. Maida? Hi, Aya. Yes, there was something I really needed to test. Uh, may I put my arms down now? Did you come back here alone? Mm, no. Daniel came with me part of the way. Well, where is he? Uh, yes. He went to look for something at the hospital. He should be on his way here. Oh. I thought he was going to say, like, now. That's why my sentence sounded a bit strange. Oh. There haven't been any combustions recently, so I, uh... Anyway, I asked Wayne to make this back at the station. Please use it. Ah, fuck. What is it? Yes, uh, I'll have to explain later. But I believe this will have some effect against Eve and the creatures she controls. Thank you. I guess I'll have to wait and see what it does. 
Mainer's gun. Attack 1, range 60, bullet 15. Handgun. Now appearances are deceiving, because that is the most powerful weapon in the game. Under, certain, uh, under a certain, certain circumstance. I came across some findings. Yes. First of all, there was, there was blood serum with Maya's name labelled on it in the freezer. My sister's name? And... Well, the research code for it was called Eve. Eve? Then Eve really is. It appears to have been made up of liver cells. He was culturing them in the past. What do you mean? What for? I don't know. There isn't any data left. But it seems Dr. Clamp has been culturing them for years. Recently, it appears he was conducting research on artificial sperm. For Eve, of course. For Eve? Uh, yes. He wanted to exclude the mitochondria from the sperm and create new sperm. Sperm with no parasites. Sperm with only the nucleus. Sperm without the mitochondria. Yes, he took the sperm that he created here and moved it to the hospital. Where we destroyed it all. There he would artificially inseminate those who would volunteer for the experiment. Then, what was that HLA list? Our HLA list for? HLA list. Professor Clamp? You ordinary beings will never, never comprehend my level of research. Professor, I'm placing you under arrest as the ringleader of this operation. What you did. This isn't something you can get away with, do you understand? You are pathetic, Brea. Are you a dick? Why put yourself in the human domain by reciting meaningless laws? They're meaningless, do you understand? We have a gun. Why are we back in nowhere? Shoot him in the leg. I guess you haven't told your little friends yet. Your mitochondria has special powers, doesn't it, Aya? But sadly, you still have the form of a human being, don't you? Why is that a sad thing? You can say all you want, but I'm just here to arrest you, Professor Clamp. I'm not letting you interfere with Eve, you hear? Do you understand? Aya, look out! Yeah, Daniel to the rescue! Clocked him good. Down for the count. Daniel, thanks. I... I didn't see the scalpel. No, oh, pardon me. Just in time. Why didn't you shoot? You could have been killed. I know. It just didn't seem real. It felt more like... Ugh. He's conscious again. Sadly. Dollis to the rescue, eh? Officer Dollis, why didn't you shoot me? What? I know you hate me. What do you want to say, huh? Of course I hate you, because of you, Lorraine's. Lorraine. Hmm, so we see that your boy managed to escape. <laughs> Jesus. I should have killed you way back. Someday you're going to pay for this. We'll see. We'll see. What are you planning to do, to do Professor? You'll love this. I'm waiting for the birth of the ultimate being. That fucking thing. The mitochondria is passed on from the mother, to, but you see, traces from the father can also be found in minute quantities. According to Eve, her sister in Japan was unable to attain her ultimate goal because the father's side of the mitochondria caused a rebellion. For Eve to succeed this time, I created sperm without the male mitochondria DNA. The creation was a success. Eve is now pregnant with Melissa's body. Pregnant? Could you not tell? She had a massive growth on her stomach. How can that be possible? Damn, Aya, we gotta kill Eve. Let's go. You humans are so weak. So stupid. You may have been able to barge in here and do things your way until now, but things are going to change. I won't let you interfere with Eve anymore. Eve, can you hear me? You don't have to wait anymore. I'm ready. What? What the hell are you talking about? Daniel made a run! She's gonna blow the whole place up. She doesn't really blow it up though, she just kind of ignites... Clamp. And that's pretty much it. So I see your mitochondrial power doesn't allow you to burn. Why? Why stay here and try to save me? First of all, I'm a cop, and it's my job. And after all, I am human. Like I said, humans are pathetic. Clamp key! Right, so now I can leave. Woo! So now we have two bosses. I don't even know if I can go... Uh, if I can go away to the NYPD. Or if I'm kind of, like, stuck here. I also don't know if I can just go down here. Would lead to a save point, which would be real nice. 
Oh, it does. Okay, good. Yeah! If I can go to the NYPD, I'm going to. I may as well try. Then I can see what kind of stuff I have. And, you know, break down most of the weapons. At the end of the day, I'll probably just put all the stats into the G22 and then transfer them over to the M8000. Yeah, because the M8000 has two fire rate. Well, technically, it's only got a one bullet fire rate. And I think it has two mod slots. Or three. Oh. Oh, right, I thought this... Oh, I thought it triggered a cutscene. Shit. <laughs> that kind of scared me. So I'm like, oh dear. Alright, just let me leave. Yeah, I just really want to see what I can... What I can do. Okay, to the PD. Downside is I'll have to... I'll have to have three slots if I do still have the tranquilizer. Shots. I guess we'll find out. Hmm. Hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Right, here we go. Right, Wayne. I think it's a Wayne. I got stuff I need to do. <laughs> You'll have ammo for me, too. This was a tool to begin with. Now it's just ammo. And the other's medicine, which I don't care for. Okay, can I just sort stuff? Yeah, just sort. Oh, no, not sort. Tune up. There we go. Right, just want to look at the mods. Yeah, I got rid of the Trank one. Son of a bitch. Oh, uh, well. In which case, I'll probably just get rid of everything, but... The... Yeah, so wait, one, two... Actually, wait. Plus one and two. Plus two and one. One and one. Holy crap, five! Five and two. Okay, yeah, and I want to. I want to dismantle that. Do I have anything else that's high? It's literally just that. Five, two, and one. Yes, please. Oh, there we go. I can actually do this. That works out. I need to just get get rid of two things. G twenty two. Give me these. Uh, yep. So now that's even better. So what's the range? Seventy. Hmm. So it would be twenty six and twenty five. Uh, 26 and 15. That would be 25 and 14. I wonder if you can do it. Oh no, I don't want to get rid of any of those. What else do I have? 2 and 3. Oh, that can only be used against other. That sucks. Hmm. That's 1 on everything. Ooh, 113. One, Which would put it up to what exactly? Oh, that works. 25, 15, 15. Yeah. And IMG 22. Boom. Right, now I don't want to use up anything. I will star everything else, though. Except for the rocket launcher, because I think I'll use that against the... Not the next boss, but the boss after that. What? Okay. Why the fuck that pop up? That's weird. Okay. Right, so get rid of this. Move. Yeah, I don't. I really don't know why that popped up. A very odd thing indeed. Right, Mater's gun. I know I can't r get rid of. So what do I have? I have the M870. Yeah, that's everything. Um, yeah. If I go to store item, god damn, Klemski. Oh, I need it. Shit, I haven't used it. Yeah, okay, we're fine. We're fine. Yeah, I probably used up, or uh, freed up plenty of space from all the tools. Why the hell did that happen? That's confusing. Mostly because I don't even know what brings up that menu. If I press the home button on my PlayStation controller, it brings up the XMB, as well as the menu that popped up. That just kind of randomly showed up. <laughs> Very odd. Very odd indeed. No. Oh. Alright, we are ready, I think. But at least this time I don't have an abundance of tools. So back to the museum. I went the longest way around. 
Alright, it's been two hours. How much longer will the game take, I wonder? An hour? Maybe? I mean, I was at three and a half. But that was after having to beat the final boss sequence, like, three times? Imagine not twice. Or was it three? Yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> so maybe it won't be that long. Who knows? It'll probably be at least three hours, in terms of how long the the session was, or is. Will you save? Yes. Now that I've actually done all the stuff I wanted to. And I have two tools which should be perfectly fine. Yep, one tool for the pistol, to get rid of the stats, and then one tool to get rid of the burst from the shotgun. Why I decided to worry so much about it, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think I just got in the mind that I could only use... Oh, the only super tools are the ones that can remove mods. For one reason or another. Right, we can go in here now. And then one more room across is where I used the key, I think. Oh, great. An enemy! I've just beefed up my weapons. You ain't gonna want to mess with me. Whoa, whoa. 97. Yeah, it goes down in three. Not bad. Yeah, whatever. Boom, boom. Soccer. Oh, nice. I'll actually... Should I use that? I'm not sure if it'll... If it triggers the boss straight away, or if it says I move. It might trigger it. I hope it doesn't. Oh, it doesn't. Good. I'm in the wrong place anyway. I need to go north. Oh, 90. That would work. Yay! Oh, there's a thing here, too. Oh, okay. Hmm. I do 50 and 75. Ouch. 37. Damn. Didn't want to do that. I can't remember which one it was. That one, I think. Oh, there we go. We got it. Yeah, we got him. I don't know what the hell that attack was. I also think I maxed out on bullets. I'm pretty sure I was at 999. And I'm probably going to max out again. I could carry two ammo crates, but there's really no point. Maybe you can hold more than 99. Or 999. Huh, I wonder. Or is it just going to be at 999 and that'll be it? Yeah. Oh well, can't complain at that. <laughs> So what it says? 25 million years ago, oxygen increased in the air. Why? Photosynthesis by bacteria. Halley's Comet dropped a meteor. Reaction between gas and H2O. Photosynth photosynthesis. Medicine 3. Use Klimt key. Alright, so this should be where the boss is. No, oh, maybe not. Where am I? <laughs> Oh, a scorpion. Nice. My favourite. Ah, oh, you dick. For some reason I thought I'd attack more than twice. To be fair, I could have actually taken a, a fire rate 2 from weapons, but eh. Or like, I should have kept a weapon to take fire rate times 2, but never mind. I think if I go upstairs, that's where the boss is. Use Clamp's key. Where's his lead? Oh, right! Now we're in this room! Oh, okay. Shit, I might actually get into another fight here. Fuck. <laughs> I do indeed. Worth it. I intended to do this. But of course. What? How did that hit me? I call bullshit. Share to reload. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah.
Oh, you're dead yet. Crap, man. Now he is. What do I get from you? Cure pee. God. Something that's worthless. Ah. <sighs> Alright, so yeah, this is where the boss is. Fun times ahead. Hmm. Oh, there we go. I can go in here now. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. It all links together. Right. <laughs> and it's boss time. As you can see, it doesn't look... Well, it's literally just a still at the moment. That's actually quite a smooth transition, to be honest. But here's the boss. Or one of them. 